Hi, my name is Cindy Herrera. I'm a criminal justice major with a triple minor in pre-law, criminal forensics, and psychology. I am currently a sophomore, so I'll be expected to graduate in 2022. Um, I'm also a commuter for Dover, New Jersey. Um, so I do all sorts of things on this campus. I'm a founding sister for Lambda Tau Mega Sorority Incorporated. I'm a part of the Color Guard for the marching band. Um, I used to be in track and field. I was a thrower. Um, I'm the choreographer for the theater club. Um, I'm also a member for the Rainbow Connection Club um, for allies and those in the LGBT community. I am a designer and a member for the uh, Colwell University Break Stigma in the athletic department, um, as well as working here in the admissions office. Um, so I chose Caldwell because of the diversity and the inclusion here. It didn't matter your sexual orientation, your gender, your religion, whether you are a first generation college student like myself or not. Um, you are a human being with hopes and dreams and a passion to change the world, and the university acknowledges that about you. The coaches, the professors, um, other staff and fac faculty here truly get to know who you are, um, what your likes or dislikes are, um, and how to help you succeed. Caldwell accepts you for you. Since I'm a sophomore going into my junior year, um, my experience only has gotten better from here. Um, I was a part of the AVID program back in high school, so when I first stepped on campus and saw how lively it was, I just, I knew in my heart that this would be the first college that I would apply to. Um, Caldwell Youth University wants your voice to be heard, um, and they truly care about the opinions of its students here. Um, so when my line sisters and I proposed the idea to create the first multicultural sorority on campus, um, and were officially uh, founded in fall of 2019. We were truly grateful to have started something new. Um, and it's all thanks to the faculty and staff who supported us. Um, and lastly, so I don't make this too long, <laughs> my one piece of advice for prospective high school students uh, and choosing a college is that I know that it's really tough with everything that's been happening and going on so it's okay to not be okay for the seniors your feelings will not be ignored due to everything that's been happening right now so it's okay to cry and feel frustrated um, but be proud of what you accomplished thus far because the college you decide to go to will be grateful for you too and for everyone else beginning to decide their future your ideas will change all the time so trust yourself and don't base it off of what your friends or your parents want you are deciding how to change the world so good luck to everybody and we'll hopefully we'll see you around